Hello and welcome. This is going to be a short video and I'm going to show you the template behind the cart page in Shopify. How you can customize it, how uh, you can add more options and then I will add the options behind the scene. So this type of video have two parts. First part I will show you where you can add door sitting and then I will show you how I can add it behind the scene and you will see what, which option I have already done. So in the previous video we work on the product page so I will close everything about this one. Then I will come back and let's close everything. So. We are in the cart page and it does not have any design. How you can add the design and where you can add it. So if you open the template, you have a file called cart.liquid. Cart.liquid is exactly the template behind your cart. So whatever you see here, all of the code is here. So like product page and collection page, if you want to have options for the user in the admin, you should extract everything to the section. For example, if I come to the online store and I'm going to show you how uh, what I mean by the settings. So if I check out my theme, currently my theme do not have any options. If I go to the customize, from here I am going to select the cart page and in the cart page you can see there is no sitting here. And you can check like if you are in any product page, you have a sitting because we add the section like product page. But for the cart page, we does not have any of those sitting. If you want to have it, as I said in the previous video, you can add it. So if I scroll down currently, it does not have any sitting here. So what I can do is, I can grab everything from here and I will come to the section and I will create a file here. Mostly I call it cart template.liquid, like product template, like collection template that we did in the previous videos. So this is the section and I will paste the code here. Now I will come to the cart. Since we cut everything, I have to uh, use the section word here and I will say cart dot, not dot, it is hyphen template. If you save it now, let's save our file. And this time if I refresh my admin, let's refresh it, it should have a cart sitting here but the sitting should be empty of course we didn't add any schema to the sitting as you can see cart template if you go inside this one we do not have any content for this one you know how to add content right just add the schema down there if you don't know what it is you can watch previous videos or you can come and copy those sitting from any other section so if i check out the product section here this is the basic schema show the social like share button or not this is one sitting you can have the same thing in the cart page that is up to you and you can add it in your template down there i'm not going to touch that one for now but i will do that behind the scene for now this is how it is going to look and if you want to customize it all you have to do is come to the sections cart template and customize it here so the code is available on github again you can do it whatever you want to do like however you want to design it but i will do it behind the scene and you will see the result in the next video and i will show you what i have done that's it for this video thank you for watching i hope it has been informative and i hope you are working along with this tutorial series and if you want to win the one thousand dollar chances are like there are not much people watching this and i just want you to learn something and start uh, running your own business that is what i want to do believe me like and currently like the view is not too much but still I'm watching the I'm creating this video so some uh, people might find it informative so that's it thank you for watching see you next time